Hey you guys, I hate how my like hair looks in this hood right now, but it's Kate. Welcome back to my channel. I'm actually so excited for this video. I've been like editing my ass off, editing all these vlogs I filmed just so I can like start filming this video because I'm so excited. But this is going to be my dorm like part two video. I don't know really. I'm going to just do everything dorm in it. So anything like so you guys know that I did that whole dorm video obviously when was it like a few weeks ago probably now um so since then i've obviously had to buy a few more things and just like do things to get ready for school and move in i move in it's tuesday i move in <clears throat> thursday not this week not in two days but next thursday nikki leaves thursday this week so i'm gonna say goodbye to her tomorrow i said bye to alana um was that yesterday yeah oh yeah that was yesterday so she left this morning she's at school um and everyone's leaving so yeah it's so weird but it's pretty exciting um so i'm doing some last minute dorm shopping and all that i have to go to target i have to do a trader joe's run because i want to just get like snacks and stuff to have um i have a bunch of things that i'm planning on doing for this video gonna get my car detailed before school just like random stuff anything I do school related even if it's not but like just to prepare to move and stuff like that it'll be in this vlog and I'm so excited because I love documenting things like this especially like big things like this I feel like I'll look back on it and be like oh my god when I moved into college <laughs> like and watch myself like being all prepa pre pre preparing to move and stuff and it'll be so funny to watch back Anyway, um, I just wanted to come on here, start this video off, and um, I have big plans. So I think today I'll go to Target and do, I need bins. So maybe container store, maybe Target, no idea. Um, I just need like organizing bins because I have everything. I just need to like put it in bins, you know, like over here on my floor, I have everything in these boxes. I don't know if you can see me. Just like all my CVS stuff. I need a few more things at Target, like cleaning supplies and stuff like that. And I just want to get big bins to organize it all so it'll be easier to transport everything, you know. And I gotta like start packing. And then packing my clothes and stuff will also document, obviously, and all that will be in this vlog. So I'm so excited. Um, I wanted to quickly come on here to show you guys I'm doing a last minute, or just my final Amazon order. I think my final, but who knows. Um, I also ordered, I've been back and forth about my comforter for my dorm forever for some reason. But I'm lucky enough to have brooklyn and reached out to me as you guys know a while ago or not a while ago but they sent me this amazing sheet set for my queen bed that i have at home obviously here that i'm sitting in and i fell in love with it it's the coziest thing ever and i was like now i don't want anything but this bedding for my dorm so i ordered a duvet cover in a twin xl for my um dorm it's the same white plain color and that's my final decision. I have the duvet, like, insert downstairs. Everything's downstairs that I need. You guys I, you guys already saw my huge dorm haul, so you know I have everything. Here's the stuff that I'm going to order on Amazon just for my final, I think, Amazon order. Because I'm trying to, well, I have a few decor items, and I'm trying to just, like, think practically for me what I'll need. So this, um, I'm going to show you guys, but I got a Dormify LED shoe that's pink, and it's, like, a Jordan high-top shoe. Um, that came a few days ago. It wasn't in my vlog, obviously, because it came, it was on back order for so long. So finally arrived. I'll show that to you guys. But I'm thinking I want these wings or yeah, like angel wings to be next to it. Like how cute would that be? Like two little LED pink things, you know? So I don't know. Someone also told me that we're not allowed to have LEDs in our dorm room. So I'm hoping I don't get them confiscated, but who knows? Um, then this blanket, I think will bring like the pink into my bedding. Cause my duvet is now, um, white so there's not going to be any really pink and then my pillows are white i don't know yeah so i wanted a little pink so i love this little knit blanket michaela um uh, my cousin has it in white in her apartment and i fell in love with it but she said definitely get pink because white gets dirty easily and i feel like pink will just tie everything together um so random chip clips in pink just because i'm weird but i feel like i'll need that because i'm gonna get lots of snacks so practical um i also decided on getting a blender it's pretty cheap for a blender like and i think it's pretty good i read about like the best college bl or dorm room blenders and i'm just such a smoothie person and i'm really really bad at eating so there's definitely gonna be especially like in college i'm gonna be like so anxious and stuff especially when i first move in i feel like i'm not gonna really eat anything so i think 
this will be a necessity for me because I'm such a smoothie person. Some people would be like, why the fuck do you need that? You don't need a blender, but like, I literally do. So, I don't know. We'll see. So I got, I'm going to get this one. Um, I don't know. It just, it seems small and it has all these little different things. So I thought it would be perfect. And then these drinking glasses I have in my house, they're just like the little beer glasses um things you know i love them so i want a pack for my dorm obviously i don't know for what like water on my bedside table i don't know um glass straws obviously same thing for the cups my fave and then thick straws because for the smoothies i would want a thicker straw and i don't know if i want to put the smoothies in this reusable cup but I want the option, so I have reusable straws and the reusable cups, obviously, for the smoothie. But I'm also thinking, what if, like, in the dorms, like, I'm not gonna really have a kitchen or a sink or anything, so I'm not gonna be able to, like, wash out this if it has, like, smoothie chunks in it, you know what I mean? So I also think I'm gonna get these, pla or, like, just throw away disposable ones in case I want to, like, take it to class and then throw it away, you know? I feel like that would be so much easier uh, for a smoothie. So these have... They're amazing. Look, they have the holes. They're like boba cups, and they have um, the straws, the thick straws, and the lids, and everything. So that's a perfect pack of 50. So, like, that'll last me forever. Um, and then <clears throat> Tupperware, I don't know why, but I have a, literally a huge fridge in the common room and my own little mini fridge. I actually have to order that. It's up here. I have to place order on that, but I'm going to rent my own fridge for my single dorm room. And um, I feel like I'll just maybe want Tupperware at some point to like store stuff in my fridge so I feel like I should have that. Scissors just random but self-explanatory <laughs> for like my desk. This Stanley cup I've been seeing this everywhere and I have a water bottle from Blue Lemon like the pink one but I kind of liked this and I'll probably bring both I don't know but I like this cup I have a Brita water bottle too to like filter the water but I feel like this will keep it nice and cold and be good to like take to class and stuff I don't know. I've been seeing everyone talk about these Stanley cups and I kind of want one really badly and then pink straws just because like look how freaking pretty they're so cute and that's it so i'm gonna place that order on amazon now um and then i'm gonna do some clothes shopping just for like back to school stuff too but not right now i'll obviously update you guys i'll show you when all this stuff arrives and give a haul and haul everything else that's <laughs> new for my dorm that i haven't showed you guys yet as i said everything dorm will be in this video so yeah i'm so excited about it just wanted to start it off here i'll probably be back later if I go to Target or something, give you a haul or take you guys with me to Target, something like that. So yeah, talk to you guys then. Hey you guys, I just received a huge package from Dormify, so I'm gonna open it. Sorry for the bad lighting, but I think it's just a pillow, honestly. So I just want to come on here and open it for you guys because why not? So let's see what it is. As I told you, I'll show you guys every dorm thing I get, so don't worry, I'll follow through. <laughs> so I got two like hot pink throw pillows and then two like whitish neutral that like, pfft, they match my barefoot dream blanket. Like, you know the cheetah print one that's at the end of my blanket or my bed. So how it's like neutral and white. So I got two pillows. This one is just like tassely. And then the other one is cheetah print and literally matches my, oh, what happened? Literally matches my, my Barefoot Dreams throw blanket perfectly. So I'll either, I mean, maybe I'll have all, both the hot pink and both the neutral throw pillows. Maybe, or maybe I'll choose between like the hot pink with the hot pink blanket or the neutrals with the Barefoot Dreams neutral blanket. Who knows what we'll end up doing, but I'm just gonna bring the bedding, all the bedding, because you never know. But this is such a cute pillow, so it's from Dormify. Look how adorable it is, just has little, like, tassels all <laughs> around it. But super cozy, and it's, like, soft and stuff. Um, this is perfect for, like, any dorm or any, like, bed, because it's, like, white, you know? So it, like, goes with everything, and it's just, like, a cute little, I don't know, accent pillow? I love it so much. Alright, that's all I got in the mail, so... That's it for now. I'll update you guys when I get anything else or if I do anything else. Hey you guys, update. I just got out of the shower, I'm about to get ready for work. But um, earlier today, me and my mom took my clothes to get hemmed. My jeans and leggings need to be hemmed. So we took them to Tony the Tailor and he's doing that. And they'll be ready on Monday. So in time for school, because I have short, the shortest legs ever so I needed 
jeans and leggings hemmed for school so i did that the already on monday and yeah that's literally all i did today um uh nikki and mia just came over to say goodbye nikki's leaving tomorrow so but she's going to providence she'll be so close to me anyway but it's still sad it's just so weird that like everyone's leaving i literally say that every time i talk about it but yeah um so yeah i'm about to get ready for work but i just wanted to update you guys that that's all i did today um i got a few amazon packages i think some of the stuff that i ordered yesterday actually came so quick sorry the lighting's so bad <sighs> so i'll open some boxes for you guys if i have them downstairs i'm pretty sure i do because i saw that some delivered Stelly's just can't even fathom the fact that we're all going to college. <laughs> Look at her. She's confused as frick. Anywho, let's see if the boxes were for me or where they even ended up. This is all my stuff. This is actually funny. Kylie's actually been getting better. She's been getting more stuff, but this is all my stuff. <laughs> and this. And this. And then Kylie's stuff. Oh. And this half of the table. This is my makeup mirror, my shoe. Oh, pretty flowers. Um, my headboard. And then this stuff's Kylie's. <laughs> Just that and like those pills I actually ordered, but I think she might want them now. Look, she got a big one. Remember, I have that little dog. Well, this would be like too big for my little dorm room anyway. But isn't it so cute? And then she also got a freaking Frenchy one. Look, she got two, but they're piggy banks. Oh wait, this is funny. I think she got them on Amazon. <gasps> They're so cute. I wish it was hot pink. I'd get one for him to be next to my doggy, the other doggy. And look, she got these too. I literally got this. I didn't get this candle, but this little thing's cute. Oh, are these fake? Oh yeah, these are probably for her apartment. Oh wait, are they? I can't tell. <laughs> we printed out these for move-in day. We gotta like put them in our <laughs> on our dashboards, I guess, so we're allowed to park or whatever. This is the new pillow that came yesterday. Did I show you guys from Dormify? I don't think I did. So this was my intention. Look, this one matches this one. They're both like neutral. Oh, I love the colors together. And they match my Barefoot Dreams blanket at the end of my bed. You know, the neutral one that's a uh, cheetah print? Perfectly. But <laughs> I got hot pink. But these could honestly all four be on the bed, right? Like that's not too bad. They're small. I got these hot pink ones and I have that um, from Amazon. I showed you guys that I ordered it the what's it called like tie tied up little blanket um that's hot pink that's like a throw blanket you know that i was telling you that michaela had in her apartment and i literally needed it so i got it so i don't know i mean i can't decide on my bed right now i'm just like i hate that i can't decide on everything right now you know like i don't know exactly how everything's gonna be so i'm like kind of freaking out that i'll forget like something but i probably will and i just have to be okay with that <laughs> okay is this box for me it must be because it's like half opened okay chase so it is for me and it is half opened let's open this we have um a little bit of time before i have to leave for work nine minutes i'll leave in nine minutes <laughs> and then what should i get to eat on my way should i get a pliable again because i'm like not really in the mood for anything else all right, but let's open the Amazon box for y'all. And I'll also probably do a TikTok haul after I open it for you guys because you guys are the priority. But I think I'm like shadow banned on TikTok or something because my videos have not been getting views like how they used to or usually do. Oh, this is just one thing I think. This is the blender. Oh no, it's a bunch of things. Er, here's the blender. This is the most important Heart. I got a magic bullet. I showed you guys this on Amazon linked in my storefront as always, but I think this will be perfect Look, it's small compact little box. So this will be perfect for my dorm room Amazing. Oops. I will not put it right in front of you guys, but I hope I have room in my little room for it Then we have two random boxes okay. These are the boba straws. I know you guys can't really see me, but these I got boba straws for smoothies because you need like a thick straw to drink a smoothie, you know? So, and I hate when the straws are too thin. And I was like, I already explained all this to you guys why I needed all these types of straws. Oh shoot. Yeah. 
but look how beautiful hello okay they're just super thick glass like the same as my other glass straws but and they're slanted like this and they apparently fit boba that's perfect and they come with a little carrier i should just put them all in there now actually perfect oh wait not if i want to do the whole on tiktok though ha <laughs> ha all right let's open the other box this little one it's probably another form of straws oh yeah the pink straws yes i'm so excited about the pink straws i didn't realize that glass pink straws were a thing once i realized it i ran to order some duh because you guys know i'm in my glass straws I'm being so weird right now because I'm like really anxious. <laughs> That's why. If you're wondering. I like tend to like make weird noises. <laughs> and like facial like brushes <laughs> that I like won't notice. Can we play it back? I probably made one. <laughs> okay, I'm excited to see these pink straws. If they'll ever come out. Oh wait, they're short as frick. Oh wait, maybe they're not. There's also a freaking bunch and a little cleaner. That's tiny compared to the Bobo one. Okay, here they all are. Let's open one up. They're really tiny, even compared to my not Bobo glass straws. You know what I mean? That's funny. They're teeny, but they'll probably still fit in a cup, right? They're really cute though. All right, I love them so much. That's everything that came from Amazon, I guess. So I'm gonna go to work. See you guys later. Hey guys, good morning. And guess what? We've officially reached, it's like under one week until I move in. It's Friday, or it's freaking Saturday and I move in on Thursday. Like what in the world? And I can't be at a good angle for me to put my camera down because I don't have my tripod. So this is how I'm gonna be. Um, today is Saturday, as I said. I don't have many plans. I wanted to, I don't know, I wrote a bunch of things in my notes that I wanted to do before school and I try to like split it between the days that I have until I go so I won't be like overwhelmed so Sunday is tomorrow is supposed to be like my clothes day so I'm gonna put away all my clothes in my closet and like get everything off my floor and then maybe I don't know how long that will take I don't know if I'll be able to do it all in like the same day but then I want to clean out my closet or slash like decide what I want to bring and start packing like I can easily pack a lot of stuff that I don't wear on the daily like weeks before because I don't wear them ever so that's kind of tomorrow's plan today's plan I'm getting my card detailed as I said I wanted to get it detailed before school so it's getting detailed at 1 it's 11 48 but I'm so happy the guy or like the company or whatever they come to your house um so I'll vlog it a little bit or I'll try to for you guys and I'll like show you guys the before and after um but hold on let me open my notes but yeah, so today we have the car detailing at 1. He'll come here. So I think I'm going to shower and like wash my hair and stuff while he's here or they. I don't know. I also want to show you guys like what's going or how they do it and stuff. Or like if they'll come in like a van. Like I have no idea. So yeah. And they're a company. They have like all, they like go all over the place. So I'll like try to link them or whatever. If I like them, of course, we'll see how they do. Um, but that's at 1. It's almost 12. So they want to go get coffee and stuff and then probably just chill until they get here and then give them my car like I don't know what I have to do I probably just be like hi here's my car go ahead and here's like the power outlet I don't know um but yeah and then after that or I'm gonna shower and wash my hair and then I want to pick up um the bag that Natasha's has she has <clears throat> I ordered two makeup bags the little like Louis lunch boxes you guys know for two of my followers because or people that saw my TikTok and they reached out to me it just I had a lot of people reach out to me asking to buy one of um, them but I just like ended up I talked to everyone I tried to like most people just like ended up not really responding or whatever so I ended up just buying two for these two girls and they arrived yesterday so I have to ship them to their houses now so I'm gonna try to do that today after that uh, because I just want to like, get that but I would hate to have to worry about that like while I'm trying to move to school um and then Target I need razor heads and bins I really need bins I have no storage bins at all and I'm literally going to school so soon and I need to just like put things in bins like I have things lying all around when if I could just put them in bins everything would be so organized you know so that honey bins <laughs> um and then just random stuff at target probably like for school and stuff we'll definitely find a million things that i need 
um, and then online shop with, um, well, I need to online shop and do a little brand thing. I don't know. I don't even know what I would call it, actually. Um, but I'm actually going to do that in this video, I think, later. I have, like, a lot of online shopping to do. I have to buy new clothes for school, basics, and then I want to buy, um, sneakers. I think maybe two pairs. So, I'll show you guys. I have a new little online tool that I want to show you guys later. But, we'll talk about that all later, obviously. And then I'm going to do an Ulta pickup order. I don't know if I was going to do that today. Well, I put it on today, but I just need... I need shampoo and conditioner for school. I know I ordered some, but I ended up using it, so I want, like, fresh, non-opened shampoo and conditioner for school, so I'm going to do that. Um, and then I just wanted, like, some extra makeup for school and stuff if I needed it, or if I need to, like, buy some more makeup. So that's on today's agenda. Tomorrow is clean-out closet, put away clothes, start packing, and then schoolwork. I have, like, random schoolwork I have to do, like, a super long alcohol course and, like, just weird stuff that I have to do. So... I'm gonna try to do all that tomorrow like tomorrow will be super chill day like stay at home and like clean the clothes do the schoolwork, whatever you know that's like a Sunday I love Sundays um, and then Monday I'm just gonna walk you through my whole week I guess because this is it's moving week I can't even believe it um okay <laughs> Monday I have I'm getting my nails done at 12 I'm gonna get um, a mani pedi I know these like Hailey Bieber nails are pretty in good shape but they're pretty grown out and I obviously want my nails done before I go to school, so I'm doing that on Monday. I'm moving on Thursday. I hope that's, like, fine. I mean, it's kind of a long time in between, but, like, my nails last forever, so it'll be fine. Um, I'm going to get a manicure pedicure. I don't know what I'll get on my nails because I love this, like, plain just Hailey Bieber nail. But, yeah. Tuesday, I, as of right now, I wrote going to Callie's. I think that's what I'm going to do because I, um, she want, or I sold her this. Did I tell you guys? Oh, no, I wasn't talking. Holy shit. I wasn't talking about this, but I got this wallet and I thought it would come different. So I sold it to my friend Callie and I was going to go to see her and like say bye and hang out before I leave for school. So, I mean, I'll probably still do that. I'm just like worried that I won't or like that I'll have so much to do and like it'll be like two days before I move in and I'll just be like stressed. But I want to get her that wallet anyway and like I feel like it's so inconvenient to do it any other way. Um, so I'll probably end up going there. Maybe I'll just, like, cut it short or, like, try to be home, you know, like, early-ish so I can, like, I don't know, but Wednesday I still have work at 5. I'm trying to get someone to cover, but no one's covering, so I don't know what I'm gonna do. And then Thursday is move-in day, so that's it. That's the plan. And I think I'm gonna go get some coffee. I have a lot of stuff to show you guys, actually. Some Amazon stuff came yesterday. Just lots of dorm stuff came yesterday, so I'm gonna show you guys that now. Do a little haul, and then I'm gonna get coffee and stuff and before my car gets detailed. <laughs> okay, wait. Um, hi. I can't show you guys my haul because um, it's all in the dining room and I literally live with my family. Like, ugh. I hate people so much. I wish I lived alone. I literally say that every single day. But I want to show you guys. I picked up my mirror. <laughs> Here it is. I've left it in my car for literally ever, but it's perfect. It's just a nice full length mirror. It's pretty heavy and it has like a little proper up thing. So I don't know where I'll put it. I mean, obviously, like against a wall or something, but I have to take this out of my car because obviously it's getting detailed. So I'm going to remove it. I'm gonna make sure everything's out of the car. The AC's blasting, it's so hot in here, but I cleaned out everything. There's nothing in my car, in the trunk, anywhere, so I cannot wait for it to be detailed. I'm gonna quickly show you guys like a before, like I wanna show you guys the whole, kind of like an overview, just so you can see, and then I'll show you the after, obviously, but. Um, so, the first thing is, I have WeatherTech mats, and they get really dirty really easily, but, the thing is like you can spill shit on them and that's why they're amazing so I love them so much but they get really dirty really easily and yeah you can vacuum them but like they get like feet like scuff mark you know like not like how a rug really does so I want these to be like deep deep cleaned I said that like I have weather check mats that I want to be cleaned and then there's just like gross shit on the ground obviously my seat is all nasty it actually doesn't even look that bad on camera but it's so gross um, I used to vacuum pretty often and then I kind of like stopped because I knew I was getting detailed soon and I was like, don't waste your time. But here's the center. Oh, I should move all, actually I'll just put the coins in the center console. But, because this, these little pockets, or I don't really like coins in here at all anyway. I'll put them in here. Um, so they can clean out there and then this stuff's pretty clean, fine. This seat is like kind of the same, just like gross. <laughs> um, and then same with that mat down there. Um, so this is the front overview. You guys will see how it looks later. The back is usually pretty clean anyway. See, my mats, like, they're fine, you know? But they'll probably, like, just touch them up and make them nice and sparkly. And then the back seats are really fine. Like, no one ever really goes back here. And then my trunk, I just cleaned all that out, but it's pretty clean back there, too. So that's everything. Show you guys everything once 
they come and detail her. But I'm gonna go to Dunks, probably get coffee, and then as I said, come back, um, like say hi to them or whatever, make sure they're fine, and then probably get in the shower or do something like that. You guys, I just thought of a fun game. <laughs> So, not really a game, but like, so since I have to take a shower anyway, and like wash my hair, wash my face, wash everywhere, I thought, once Chris gets here, Chris is on his way here, did I say that? Oh no, I didn't, the guy, I just got a text, it's like really cool, high tech, like, they text you, it says Chris is 59 minutes away, but he is late, it's 1.03, and he's gonna be here at like 1.30ish, <clears throat> so once he gets here, I'm gonna like go and like greet him, I guess, and then make sure he's fine, and then make sure I can like take a shower and not have to worry about him, <laughs> so... That's what I'm gonna do, but I told my mom I'm scared to talk to Chris alone, so she said she'll help me, I think. But I decided, since I have to like go to Ulta Place and Ulta order and stuff, I don't know exactly what I need and what I don't because I haven't really been doing my makeup that much, you know? So I don't know what I need for makeup, but I'll probably, do, probably be doing my makeup more in college because I'll probably be like doing stuff more, you know? So I want to make sure I have everything makeup wise. I got recently like the Charlotte Tilbury um, foundation, but it's really light. So I might want to get the next shade darker so I could like mix them because I am that shade right now. But like I kind of want to tan before school because I'm so pale, I guess, because I'm the lightest shade ever. Um, and I haven't done my makeup in forever. So basically, yeah, I just want to like do my makeup, see what I have, see what I need, see what, you know? And I like to like play with makeup and I like won't have to worry about it because I can just like shower. I'll be like showering after anyway. Like that's fun for me. So I thought that would be fun. <laughs> um, and then maybe I can do like eye masks when I get out the shower. But what else? Yeah, so I'll probably like film maybe a little bit of the makeup for you guys because that will be fun. And then we can figure out what I need, place the auto order, probably pick it up later. Um, yeah, but I'll let you guys know when Chris is here. I'm like, I get nervous talking to people I don't know. And when people come to my house, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure he's just like a normal, professional guy, but I'm scared of him. Alright, talk to you guys later. Hey you guys, I just showered, I washed my hair, I used my new Target towels, I'm so obsessed with them. Um, that arrived in the mail, I actually didn't show you guys them yet because I haven't showed you the haul yet, but they were like the waffle towels that I love so much, I showed them on my TikTok. Um, but yeah, I just got dressed, put on my favorite Free People tank, and these are Ritzia, just like cozy pants. Um, I think I'm gonna go to Target and Ulta. Well, he's still cleaning my car, but he should be done in like, I don't know, he got here at 1.30, so like 2.30, 3.30 will be two hours. So yeah, under two hours, I think it was supposed to be, so he should be done by then. Um, and then me and Avery, I think, are gonna go to Target and Ulta. I need my shampoo, maybe a few other things at Ulta, and then Target, I need bins, I think. And yeah. Maybe we'll stop at Starbucks on the way because I want that, but I'll show you guys what I get and stuff. Okay, you guys, a little change of plans. I really thought my mom was going to let me take her rental car, but she's not because I'm not 25 and technically I can't have a rental car, but I thought she wouldn't care, especially because I was with my little sister, but apparently not. <laughs> I could take my dad's car, but I'm not a huge fan of it. It's just, it's like a, a sedan and there's nothing wrong with it at all. It's just really old. I can't play my own music in the car. It's like, has, it literally has the radio. Um, it's a nice car. It's an Audi and he's so obsessed with it. Like it's funny how obsessed he is with it. And it used to be his dad's and his dad just like had it forever. So he like loves it so much and bought it from his dad. Um, when his Range Rover broke down like last year and he was supposed to buy a new car in the meantime, this was just supposed to be like his filler car, but he still hasn't bought a new one and he's like so obsessed with it for some reason. So yeah um he also just like never got around to buying a new car he's like never gets around to stuff like that but um so i didn't really want to take his car all the way there but i might just take it to starbucks now because wait did i even finish i don't even know where i ended up talking but me and avery are now gonna go tomorrow i think to target and ulta and i'll place my order maybe tonight to pick it up tomorrow i don't know we'll see but i think we'll do that tomorrow because tomorrow's sunday I remember i told you guys i just want to do all my clothes stuff tomorrow but maybe i'll switch and try to do some of that today or at least putting the clothes away today and then we can do Target and Ulta tomorrow, get bins, and then I'll get everything organized Sunday, and then we'll be good, like, going into Monday and going into the week, and I'll just do, like, little things, you know, so I'm not overwhelmed. So, yeah, that's the plan. I think I'm gonna go try to use my dad's car to go to Starbucks, though, because I still want Starbucks. Hey, guys! Hey, guys! Okay, we're going to Starbucks in dad's car, and it's so hot, and the AC barely works, but... The wheel is metal. I mean, look, it's red. That's cool, but it's burning hot. Um, so we're gonna try to drive this. I feel like Mima or something. Mima? Yeah, I don't know why. They're like, not in this car. Grandpa's Jaguar? Yeah. Oh, wait, what happened to that? Does he still have that? 
I think so. Okay, drive. Should I just hold it or put the camera somewhere? Um, well, I don't think there's really anywhere to put it, but okay. it's okay. You can turn it off in a second. So we're going to Starbucks, and I have some free drink cards, so whoa, I have to get used to this. So we're gonna go in and order them with my free drink cards, maybe, and see if they can take them. I'm gonna have my third strawberry acai. Oh my god, <laughs> it's your third? Yeah. God, maybe you should get it. You should find a new drink that you like. Or well, you can switch up with. I don't know what I would. I don't know what it'd be though. I've never tried coffee. Okay, we'll ask them. Say, do you guys have any drink recommendations? Tell them what you like. Hey guys. Uh, <laughs> You're already recording. You didn't even say that. Hey guys, I'm a bit awkward. I just wanted to let you know, but um. um do you have any drink recommendations <laughs> for Starbucks? I like to. <laughs> We have to drop the weird music. Yeah, what is this? You guys, you hear it? It's like... Okay, there we go. It's in French! Oh, that's why. Oh, no, English, Espanol. Oh, they have all languages. Like so guys, um, um, so Avery only gets strawberry size, but she goes yeah mm, like three times a day. So yeah, I get strawberry size and a so brownie. So we need to find something to switch it up for her. What's a drink? Yeah, that's she doesn't like coffee, so like a refresher or yeah. have you tried the passion tea? No, I used to get that all the time. That was being Kylie's drink. Those were a thing. They were so, so let us know. Yeah, I best. like drinks that are pink. Yeah, like the passion fruit. Yeah, I like pink lemonade. Have you tried the mango dragon fruit? No. Oh, I have. But I didn't get like dragon fruit in it. Oh. Oh, so it wasn't white or clear? Yeah, it was clear. It was yeah. really weird. Well, was it didn't good? have a strawberry side. That one's good. I like the color too. I wouldn't want to drink a clear beverage for some reason. I don't know why you don't like it with lemonade. It's so much better with lemonade. Well, I haven't had it in so long with lemonade. I don't know. I feel like the flavor is just richer strawberry. Three days in a row I had the most amazing strawberry size. I sent you really? them. They were so good. What do you mean you sent me them? I sent you photos of them. Oh. And I told what you how amazing get? they were. I got strawberry size and lemonade with light ice. Oh. Well, is that what you're going to get today? Maybe you can let me try it with lemonade. Yeah, I will. <laughs> but I guess I will. You guys, the car looks great. Oh, did I? I did, oh, you have, girl, look at what you're showing. You're doing this too. Well, the car what am I showing? Oh, I'm so sorry. I don't know how to do this. And I'm not you're a good camera. Hold it from here. Let me show you like this, because like down here you can't touch those or the sound. Okay, wait. Be so bad. I hold it from here. You look like see how it's a little handle. But I feel like I'm gonna press a bunch of buttons. But you won't. You just like have to get used to it a little. It's a one-handed thing, but you just have to get used to it. Um. So I checked out my car. I paid him. So the total was 235, but he did an, like whole sanitary sanitation something. <laughs> so it was a little extra. So I think it's usually 200 because that's how much it would have been more if Kylie got hers, but she didn't. Girl, I can't see my face. I don't know how to do this. Oh, and you got me out of my second day of school. Yeah, I did. Thanks, girl. I forced mom to let Avery come from yeah. over there. She's gonna move in with me. Yeah, we're gonna go to college. And so that'll be on Thursday. Maybe you could be the cameraman then because I'll be able oh to teach you. Oh my gosh. I'm not really better good at, at this. Yeah, well, I used to film those weird YouTube videos where I'd be like, oh, remember my bathtub? YouTube channel? Mm -hmm. Not in the bathtub. Well, I remember one video in the bathtub. Wait, no, like, no, that was when I was seven. Like my, oh, I had one. I had a weird YouTube channel in like oh. quarantine, and I made the weirdest videos. So how'd you? Were you a bad filmer? Yeah, and I can't delete them because I don't know the login, and they're so embarrassing. Wait, that's actually funny. Yeah, I can't delete them. So, guys, don't look me up. Um, wait. So I didn't finish. So the total was that, and then I tipped him forty-five dollars because. That's how much my mom told me to. And at first I did 45 cents, and then I was like, oh my god, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do 45 cents. I was like, shoot. And then he was like, oh, that's okay. I was like, can I do it again? Like, can I cancel it? And he's like, uh, yeah, I can figure it out. <laughs> and he like has an accent, and like, I, I don't know, I couldn't, it's just, it just stresses me out when I talk to people, I don't know. Oh my Wait. gosh, the movers Oh my god, there's no backup camera. I used to own a backup camera, I should be good at this. So basically, he did an amazing job, and he let me see it, so. He said 25 more minutes because I think the sanitization thing has to do Just whatever he's doing. And I couldn't breathe it. So he was like, go look out, but don't breathe in. And I like was holding my breath and stuff. But it, looks, <laughs> it looks amazing. The mats are so clean. Everything's so clean. Way better than when I got it detailed at the place I tinted my windows. I think because this guy's probably like specialty is, to, is the detailing. Whatever. Okay, we're going to go in and get our strawberry a size and whatever. Yeah. And see you later. I'm going to try to use my free drink cards. I have, let's see how many I have. Why do you have free drink cards? Because you know when they're like out of something and they just give you this? What? 
if you like order like a grilled cheese online and they don't have it in store, they do that. Then they'll just they give that. you like a five dollar oh, gift card. Very well. Sorry, I wasn't. I only have two, so we'll see if they can pay for both of our drinks. Okay, let's go. Bye guys. Wait, how do I stop it? Hey guys, we got our strawberry size, and yep. we used both of the cards. Avery was in charge of Dad's little key. Yeah. We used both of the gift cards, and we I had a remaining balance of like two dollars, but it was okay. Look at the screen pops out. So this is mine. Can I try yours? Yeah. Avery got the lemonade. The lemonade's so much better. Can I try yours? Mm -hmm. Why is yours cold though? I mean, not cold. <laughs> Wait, they taste the same. I feel like they do too. And they kind of look the same. Light I know water. mine has lemonade. You can tell? Yeah, mine's just like, I also just brushed my teeth though. I don't know, I mean, they're both pretty good. Oh. This car keeps beeping in random ways. Okay, you guys, we're gonna go home. I'm scared that when I take the key too far from my car, it's gonna lock the car and then lock him out of it. <laughs> and then he's gonna be like trying to do his work or whatever and be locked out. Do you think Stella's gonna like hop in the car? No, right? No. She wouldn't hop in. She was there in the beginning and Dad was like, oh, you don't mind my dog, do you? And he was like, oh, it's fine. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go check on the car. Okay, you guys, it's finished. He just left, so we're going to go look at it. Stella's gonna look too, I think. He did let me see it as I showed you guys, but I wanted to, or I couldn't film it in front of him, obviously. So let's open it. I hope I'm allowed to breathe it, right? What? I don't think he did the outside. Yes, did he? I think so. <laughs> Wait, he did? What did you ask for? I asked for an interior detail. No, I don't think oh, yeah, he did no, the outside. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're like, wow. Are the mats in? Oh, look at the mats are so, see, you didn't see it before. It was so no. gross. Oh, your wallet. Or it wasn't so. Oh, it wasn't so gross. But oh my god, it smells. It smells so good. Wait, are you supposed to breathe? I think now I can breathe it in. It's just it so clean. Like strawberries. Did you get to choose the smell? No. Oh, look at I the just. Back. Wait, let me see. Hold on. It's so like. It's all ready to yeah. He, I know. He didn't do the outside for sure. No, no, he didn't do the outside. The mats are so clean. Like the mats have never been this clean. They're usually like so gross and like marks. Wow, it smells so yummy. I can't believe it. How do you think he does that with the smell? Like, I feel like I can't make my car smell so good. Wow. Oh my god. So and like the doors. Did you put Melvin back? There he did. Oh, I hope so. Oh, he put a little. Oh, oh is that the scent? Or no? Oh, so show them. No, it doesn't to promote matter. them. This is their brand, Flow Auto Care. We had Chris, and he was amazing. And But I'm sure anyone is amazing. And my little vacuum was in there. And look, like, I don't know. These were all so gross. It's like, like Brits. Even I the read cup the website holders. that said it would be, like, brand new. Yeah, it really it is. literally is. And, like, the doors, like, everything, like, you don't notice until it's so yeah, clean. I know. Wow, and even, like, here. Wow. Good job, Chris. Amazing. Live, love, Chris. Okay. Hey guys, I'm in the car wash. I'm so excited. So me and my mom, I didn't tell you guys at all, like we peeled off the back sticker. You know how my Brian sticker was so um, crooked and my, I've had like a headache all day. I can't be screaming. Um, <laughs> my, the BC sticker I had underneath it, I took it off and it still had goo residue. So we got all that off and that's why, that's mainly why I'm in the car wash. I also just wanted my um, outside of my car done after like the whole interior was done. I felt like that kind of made sense <laughs> but it's about to be really loud actually in here so i'm gonna turn this off but i just want to say i'm in the car wash melvin loves it in here and my car is gonna be even more brand new you guys i'm having the hardest time deciding on sneakers so i think i really decided that, that decided that i really want these even though they're like the more expensive out of the ones i'm deciding between i saw them on maggie and i just i can't get myself to stop thinking about them so I feel like I should just, I was going to get two pairs because I wanted like, well, I wanted to get these um, pink ones and they're not, they're 120, which is like half the price of those, obviously. So I was going to get two pairs and get like one pink one and one white pair. And I was either going to do like these hot pink ones or these regular, these are more red, I think they're called like siren or something, siren red. Um, these are really similar to these, but they're Nikes and they're a hundred, which is way cheaper. But I kind of decided, like, I just really like these. Like, I love the details. I like that they're New Balances. I don't have New Balances. And, I don't know. These Dunks are the cutest things ever. But they're so expensive. 282 Like, what? So, I'm really having a hard time. And then up here, I have these New Balances, which are only 99 But, 
I don't know, I'm not getting the best vibe from them. Like, I'm just so obsessed with these ones. I want them so bad. Say hi. <laughs> Sally's hiding her bone in my Ikea bag, but we're sorting through everything, trying to like get everything together. These are all like the neon signs. Um, I didn't show you guys the new Angel Wings one, but it's pink too. Oops. And everything. I'll put the shoe over here. The clothes? The pillows. Oh. Put some stuff over here. Is this all stuff no. to wash? Yes, this is all. Okay, Tupperware, ice cube trays, blender, Brita's. And lots of straws. Lots of straws. Okay, all of this shit that's literally been on my floor forever is finally going in a box. Good morning, you guys. I literally leave for school in two days. It's Tuesday, I leave on Thursday. I can't even like, this is so not real. I don't wanna go at all. <laughs> like literally at all. But whatever, we'll figure it out. I guess we'll go, maybe. I like literally don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't wanna go to school at all. And everyone's already at school, so it's like, at first, okay, at first I was like, I need to just get to school. Like everyone's at school, everyone's already having fun. Like once I get there, meet everyone, like I'll start having a great time and just love it. But now I'm kind of like seeing everyone go to school and I'm like, I'm fine if I don't do that, you know, like I would be fine not because I don't want, I don't have a desire to, I mean, I know I talk about this one time, but like I don't have a desire to go to college. I don't have a desire, not even the school aspect, like I'd be fine being at home and like doing school during the day. It's just like the college aspect, like I hate being social more than I want to, if that makes sense, like I'm very like. If I don't want to be social, I cannot have people around me. And that's what, and like I need my alone time. And I feel like when you're like living in a dorm with millions of people around, you never get alone time. And there's just so many people and whatever. And I know that like I'll probably get into my routine and figure it out and whatever and figure out how to like have my time alone and still enjoy people and make all these new friends, whatever. I'm sure that'll happen, but it's just like so hard to like be so excited when you like are literally just dreading it like i have no desire to move to this place i have no desire to be in this scene i have no desire like even school in general i hate like i don't know it's horrible but we'll figure it out i don't know um i brought i we figured out everything downstairs yesterday as you guys saw my mom washed all my bedding everything's clean all my towels are clean and i just have a few things so i have like this whole sephora bag is filled with new makeup that i still haven't um unpacked so i have to clean up my makeup bag and unpack my new makeup and then i have just a little random tray with skincare, Laneige, Q-tips, eyelash spoolies, random stuff that I'm also bringing. And yeah, so tomorrow, I mean today I'm gonna start clothes, but I think tomorrow we can like spend most of the day doing clothes. And since it'll be like the day before, like I'll be like obviously motivated, like I think I'll be fine. I'll be fine with clothes and I think it'll be easy because it's literally just what I wear and what I don't, you know? <laughs> and like what I think I'm gonna be wearing and what I think I don't. Also picked up my alterations i got my what well you guys saw i got my um nordstrom jeans hemmed look how perfect like look how beautiful they're just like don't even look like they've been touched and these the lulu leggings they literally have a seam can you see it no wait why can't you see it i swear there's a seam like right there <laughs> 
Okay. So, I wanted to try on <coughs> these, but I might just get dressed. I have to go to Trader Joe's today, I think, and maybe Target. Yeah. Okay, you guys, I put on a fit. Free People Tank, Aritzia, shorts. I think it's pretty hot out. Um, I think I'm going to go to Starbucks and then Trader Joe's, like right now, this morning. So we can get that out of the way and come home and then just chill and pack. So how I started in Kylie's room, I threw, so I had just like a, all my clean clothes would just be like right here, kind of like I wouldn't hang them up and just continue to get them cleaned and then my mom would put them here and then I'd wear them and then she would wash them, put them here and it would just keep going in a circle. So all of those clothes that I wear on the daily and stuff, I threw into Kylie's room. <laughs> so this is a good place to start, I think. I'll just, I'll come home, sit on the floor, organize it all into piles because either way I need to hang it up in my closet or take it to school. I think most of this will be taken to school because this is the stuff that I wear all the time as I said, but yeah. So I'm going to come home and just sort through clothes, put them all into piles. I won't even decide like what to wear yet or what to not, or I'm sorry, what to bring yet or what to not. I'll just sort into piles. Like I'll try to like zone out and just do lots of like sorting, folding with clothes and stuff. And I think I'll be okay. And then if I need help like deciding or packing up or stuff like that, I can have my mom help me with that. But I think just like folding the clothes and putting them in piles, I'll be fine. I could just like zone out, put on a show or something, try not to stress about it and be okay. But yeah, I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's. I'll these take you guys with me or I'll definitely show you guys a haul of what I get. So I'm gonna go to Starbucks and try to uh, go to Starbucks and try to try one of the new fall drinks because I think they just came out today, the fall drinks. I don't know which, which one I want. We'll see. I'm like so out of breath and I'm also so hungry all of a sudden for some reason. I'm never so hungry right when I wake up. So it's weird, but that's a plan for right now. I ate my bagel in the car. I didn't show you guys, but I got, oh, I went to Starbucks. So I didn't even show you guys. So I get so confused when I TikTok buck too, but I got a pumpkin cream cold brew. It's so freaking bomb. Like I just tried it on my TikTok. It was amazing. And I got everything big with cream cheese that I just ate. But the coffee's amazing. I just think I'm dehydrated. So I'm like craving water. So I just got this nice ice cold water. My mom just cleaned my bottle and it's so good. <laughs> oh my God. That's exactly what I needed. Before I can like drink my coffee, I feel like I need to be hydrated. But we're going to Trader Joe's. As I said, to get school snacks and stuff. Natasha just came and dropped off the two little Louis bags that I'm mailing to two people and then I had to mail another little wallet to Callie. So we did that. Now everything's mailed or being sent out, which is good. This water's way too good, oh my God. But the pumpkin cream cold brew was so bomb. Um, okay, we'll go to Trader Joe's. Okay guys, here's my Trader Joe's haul. I have two big bags and I'll just start. First I got so smooth, so loud. I got white cheddar corn puffs, my fave, but I also got, I think I've tried these before, but just not in a while, sour cream and onion version. I love sour cream and onion, so I was like, why wouldn't I get them? I didn't know they had them, or maybe, I feel like I've had them before a long time ago. Who knows, but. Those are snacks, probably all for school. I got three um, more of the pork dumplings for the freezer because I love them. And I got more silver dollar pancakes because I love them too. I love like just the things that go in the freezer and then you can microwave them and then they're done. I got lemonade, Avery. No. Oh, okay. It's Trader Joe's original lemonade. Two more dumplings. And then frozen fruit for maybe my blender. <laughs> Who knows if I'll actually end up bringing this because like I feel like freezer stuff is so hard to bring, but if not, I'll leave in my freezer here. I got a berry blend and another berry blend, but this is a cherry berry blend and this is not cherry berry blend. I also got orange juice for calcium. This is the more fun bag. So I got my fave dark chocolate marshmallows. I got two of those, but we'll find it later. More sourdough because I love sourdough. I got these, another more, another snack, a little, whatever they're called. <laughs> um, more marshmallows. Fave. 
I got muffins for some reason. I had one last night, a muffin, not those muffins, and it was so good. So I was like, let me buy more muffins. Um, do you want my receipt every? I'm kind of lazy. I can't <coughs> be doing my touch rewards anymore. Really? Look how just never get there. <laughs> okay, the dark chocolate mint um, little candies too. And then these are my dad's fave. The peanut butter cups or so much stuff buying them so I bought more and that's everything so it's actually not that much it was only like $60 which is not a lot compared to how much it usually is so yeah I'm back in the car you guys saw my Trader Joe's stuff but it's one o'clock I have to do packing and stuff but what do you do when your sister tells you that she needs plan B you gotta go get her plan B so that's what I'm doing I'm going to CVS I'll get her plan B and I actually need um um razors and i think i just need a lot of razor heads for school i got a razor for school so i just need a lot of heads because i like go through them so fast so i'll get that at cbs too and i think that's all i need and then i'll be good for oh just cut me off okay um for everything i think i'll be good y'all okay i just got my zara package in so let me do a quick haul i literally just threw everything on the floor so let me do a quick haul um and i'm gonna try everything on so i'll show you guys too but I got just like basics for school, so this just like cropped little tee in white, and then I also got it in black, you know, just like basics, and then I got this little tank, like the higher neck one that like everyone has, I feel like. I feel like it's cute with like jean shorts or something for like, I don't know, a fit for, I have um like welcome week the first whole week, so what do I like wear to that? Probably just like basics, like these things, like tank. I don't know. I want to try these on, though, because I've never tried on, like, a high-neck thing like this, so I want to see what it looks like. I put a bunch of pairs of shorts, like, talentless shorts, and then jean shorts. I'll bring them all, I guess. And then I just got this fun top. It's, like, denim corset-looking top. I don't know. I'm going to try it on. It's, I thought it looked fun, but it looks kind of big, but it's an extra small. Like, it looks, like, wide, but maybe that's just because it's a jean material, so it doesn't stretch at all. And then two pairs of jeans. I got the Zara, my favorite marine straight leg jeans in black i have them in white and oh i don't even have them in pink my pink ones from zara are not these um but i love these so much they fit amazing they're so cute so i got them in black <laughs> i'm so out of breath for some reason everyone in my tiktok comments is so rude to me about how fast i was going but i just didn't want to have to make a part two but i ended up having to make a part two anyway and then everyone's like post the part two post the part two and i'm like it's been up for so long go watch it what do you mean just go check my account like sorry Ugh whatever okay and then i got this pair of wide leg straight jeans you know from zara of course but the ones that i just got hemmed from tony i also want to try them on probably these are the north from bp and they're gonna be the perfect length because they're gonna fit me perfectly oh i can't wait so i'll probably have to get those ones hemmed too but it's okay I could do that, right? Okay. That's everything from the Zara package. I'm going to try everything on. You guys, the jeans are so long. Like, I was right. Like, they're just so long. But it's okay. The top's fine. I'm going to try on the Nordstrom jeans. Yay, I love these ones. They're not too long. It's so weird when jeans aren't too long. So I'll just wear sneakers with these, obviously. Oh my god. I'm so obsessed with them. They're just like regular, but I like how they're like comfy, chill, whatever. I'm still wearing the same top. Okay, here's the t-shirt. I literally love it so much. It's so freaking soft. It's so cute. Nothing really special about it, but it's like tight. It's cropped. It's exactly what I wanted. So I just got out of the shower. I didn't wash my hair, but ate some pesto totally. The mom made me too. But my car charger's broken, so I'm replacing it with this one that's hopefully not broken. Um, and I think I'm gonna go to Tar- well, no, Ulta. I wanna go to Ulta first. Hopefully they're still open. Wait, I should Google it. I mean, it's only 5.45. I need my shampoo and conditioner from Ulta. And then I wanted to go to Target too, but I could go there after. It's like right near there. I spilled my entire strawberry acai after I bought it today. And it was way earlier today, so I was thinking, oh, it says till 8, 8 p.m. So I was thinking I should go get another one. <laughs> Sorry, I got distracted. So I want to go to Target and 
Ulta. I'm gonna go to Starbucks first. Let me try to order it. My cold brew this morning was so amazing. I just, what happened? I didn't drink it because I was in um, Trader Joe's and then it was like all melted by the time I got home and I just like, I don't know. I don't even remember the problem. Oh, it was because I ate my whole bagel and I'm so bad at eating. Like if I eat a normal amount, for a meal because that's a lot for me it like makes my stomach hurt so bad i feel so full i feel like i'm gonna throw up even if it's like not that much food at all like a half of a bagel you know like with cream cheese it like made me so upset <laughs> so yeah i'm gonna go to st they're sold out of strawberry acai how well let's go to the drive-thru because that's on the way are they sold out no okay we'll order this to the drive-thru on the way and maybe once i get to target uh, yeah because target's my last stop if the starbucks and target um i've been seeing that you can get a free refill from target starbucks's or something and maybe you have to have bought it at that specific starbucks but i don't think first of all i don't think it matters second of all i don't think they would notice they wouldn't be like oh you didn't buy this at this one like i'd be like yes i did <laughs> and they would be like i'm oh, sorry i didn't remember like you know um so maybe I'll be done and I can get a free refill or we can try that out and see if that hack works. Uh, okay, that's enough hour. Um, okay, we're at the drive-thru so I thought I'd pull up the camera. I don't know why, I just always need to be filming myself. If it's not a TikTok, it has to be you guys, like. <laughs> Hello, I just had a mobile order for Kate. Okay, yep, we have that. All right, thank you. I need a car tripod so badly. I know I always say that literally every single time. Grounds. Wait, free to take. Grounds for your garden. Oh, wait. Using, I can't read it. Using our ground coffee, fuel your garden. Replace pH levels. Grease soil. So they're saying they have like coffee beans in bags right there on the ground outside. And it says you could take them to fuel your garden with Starbucks coffee beans. I think it's probably like the faulty beans that like they don't want to use. So like they're saying you could like take them for free to put in your garden. That's kind of funny. I wish I had a garden. I was going to start a garden. That was going to be my summer activity. I like was looking for something to be passionate about, I guess. And then TikTok kind of took over, so. I'm super glad that I didn't have to become a gardener. <laughs> this is taking for Evs, and I literally had a mobile order. And no, I can't go inside. People like love to be rude to me. <laughs> like they'll be like, "Why don't you just go inside? Why do you have to be in the drive-through? Like why are you gonna blah, blah? like people like will be rude or complain about anything I do? Literally anything. Like it's funny because they'll get mad at me for trying to go super fast, so I didn't have to make a part two. But then they'll also get mad at me for making a part two because I couldn't go that fast. And I'll get, and then I'll also get yelled at for like just stupid shit. Okay, wait, I'm kind of stuck at this on. Hold on, hold on, let me accelerate. <laughs> okay, I got it. It looks so bomb. Look at it. Oh my god, it is so bomb. Okay, so we'll go to Ulta and then Target and then maybe they'll refill this if it's empty. I forgot to show you guys what I got at Ulta. The door's open now, but I guess who cares? So first of all, what I went for, also my total was like $140. Keep in mind that while I show you what I got and how much I got. My favorite shampoo and conditioner, Pureology. Got, had to get a new one for school. I'm gonna like go fill up my little shower caddy with like my, all my shower stuff like, and make sure it's all open and like my face wash and stuff, just so I'm all ready. I feel like it's so pointless to bring like a bunch of boxes of like face wash, box, face wash, or body wash box like you know it's stupid and then this um emma was talking about the born this way concealer in her one of her like tiktok hauls recently and i used to also use this all the time and then i kind of like forgot about it so i got it in two different shades cream puff and swan um i kind of like i didn't have someone test me for the colors but i was kind of like holding them i didn't want to get makeup on my face i don't want to break out i don't want to break up for the next like day before i go because i don't want to break out at all but um i was like holding it i put them on a sponge and then i like, held them up and like saw and it looked like i was kind of between these two colors so i got them both i think this one's probably me right now and then this one will be me if i get any tanner which i hope i do because i'm literally so pale i'll either have to self tanner or find a way to get tanner because i'm so pale right now and that's it i went to nordstrom rack didn't get anything just looked around for like a little white tank top 
and I couldn't find one because I wanted a white tank top for move in day. Hi, you guys. There's something weird going on with my camera. And I can't figure it out. Maybe it's just the weird lighting that I'm in. But it's officially Wednesday. It's literally one day until we leave. This is so freaking insane. So it's 10.30 a.m. I have a lash appointment at 12 and that's it. And then I have to just literally pack the entire day. Because I haven't started packing my clothes or anything. And I want to look pack up the car and everything before I go to bed tonight. I feel like that'll be like the best idea. Got some ice water because I was really craving some ice cold water. But it's 10.30 right now so I don't know what I'm going to do until 12. I was trying to think of if there's anything that I had to do. Like anywhere I had to go before school. I can't think of anything. Except for the mall because I wanted a white aligned tank. That fits me. Mine's a six. I don't know why. But I'm a two so I don't know why I'd buy a six. Maybe I didn't buy it but I don't know who would have. So I don't know. It like fits me uh, okay but I want it to be tighter like the over here is like just loose and I don't like that. So I wanted to get that because I wanted to wear a void line tag on move-in day. How freaking random. But I had this outfit picked up because I placed an order on Revolve for these aloe shorts and they're black like workouty shorts but they have like white aloe on them so I thought like the white top would be cute because it would go together with my panda dunks. Um, but yeah, that's the deal. Yesterday I didn't do any packing. I haven't packed clothes yet. I haven't packed anything. I was supposed to pack clothes yesterday, but I... What did I even end up doing yesterday? Oh, I went to Trader Joe's and I went to Tarte, or I don't know what I went to Ulta, got shampoo, conditioner, stuff like that. Um, and then me and Dana went out to dinner and got sushi. And then I literally went to bed at 11, like... 11 30 i think like it was insanely early actually let me check because it was so early i literally knocked out i was so tired oh it was 12 okay 12 exactly should i go and get an aligned tank because then i won't have to stress about my moving in day outfit and i think that's my problem and if i don't have anything else to do yeah let's go to lulu i guess we can get an aligned tank do i need anything else at the mall for school all right let's just go call lululemon one option is Lululemon on Worcester Street. Is that the one you're looking for? Oh, it's not open yet. I think they open at 11, but maybe someone will answer. I said call and they're rooting me. Shut up! Oh my God. I need to call. I was gonna call to see if they have the leggings or the um, aligned tank that I want so they could like put it on hold or something. Cause I feel like it's like a waste of time if I go all the way there for an aligned tank they don't have. So, I thought I'd call, but see, the annoying thing is when you search like something, something near me, like Lululemon near me, the nearest one does not come up. Like, I'm closest to the Natick one, obviously. I'm also closest to the Chestnut Hill one, though neither of them come up. Like, what? Okay, whatever, bye. Okay, I don't know what my problem is. I stepped outside and it was way too bright for me to even open my eyes, and it's not even that sunny out. So I was like walking like this, and now everything just feels so bright to me. <laughs> okay, it's 11.13 now. Just went into the mall, and I got the Align tank. And what size did I even end up getting? I think I ended up getting a four. Oh no, I got a two. I was gonna say, yeah, I got a two. Here it is, it's just white, it'll be perf. I'm so excited, and it'll go with my aloe shorts and my pen dunks. That'll be my movement day fit. Okay. And I guess I'll wear like a hoodie too. It's 11.14 and my appointment's at 12, so I'll just go home for like a sec and then go to my appointment, I guess. But I'll see you guys after. You guys, I just, okay, I just got on my lunch appointment. I was sitting here literally on my phone saying to myself, like, not recording myself, like, I'm like, it's okay, I'll be okay. Everything will be okay. Like, I'm saying that verbally to myself while I'm just sitting here and I like didn't even realize. Um, so I decided that that's probably a sign that I need to take on my vlog camera because I'm literally talking to myself. Um, I got a ticket, freaking ticket, from my parking, but I did my lashes, and I don't know why the lighting's so bad. I think there's, like, a little glare right there. Yeah. So my lashes, they look amazing. Oh my god, they look amazing. And she did my brows! Or, she didn't, like, do them. She just, I asked her to clean up the bottom because last time I tried to tweeze my eyebrows, I don't know what happened, but 
okay i like grossed out very easily but like things like blood can't do anything about blood tattoos are different for me like i don't know i can do tattoos i'm i can do some sort of needles i can't do taking blood shots are like eh, a little bit weird but like um most of the part most of the time i'm okay with normal activities for some reason i used to pluck my eyebrows all the time by myself just pluck them whatever and i'd be fine i would just clean them up a little for some reason lately i tried to pluck my eyebrows like um recently and it just grossed me out so much like i don't know what the deal was i don't know what happened i was freaking out i was like ooh, like i don't even know i couldn't do it. i couldn't finish so i was like i'm going to college tomorrow i'm gonna want to do my eyebrows tonight or like make them look at least good so i asked mary and she just cleaned them up um underneath a little bit and my mom was the next appointment so she was in the waiting room and she was like let me just go tell your mom that i'm gonna tweeze your eyebrows and i was like thank god it wasn't like a random person because they'd be like so angry that i'm running over their time just so i can get my eyebrows tweezed but my mom obviously didn't care um i also made her switch appointments with me she was supposed to be at 1 30 and i was supposed to be at 12 but i mean other way around i was supposed to be at 1 30 she was supposed to be at 12 so i took the 12 and now I'm gonna get Starbucks and then go home and pack my ass off. <laughs> oh my god, my hair. Okay, starting packing, but I just got a Princess Polly <clears throat> package. So I'm gonna quickly open it. I'm in Kylie's room, obviously. There's no mattress on her bed. I'm just starting to sort all of these in piles of like what they are, and then I'll decide like. How many leggings do I bring? How many of these? Or which ones of these do I bring? You know, that's how I'll decide. Had to do express shipping. But is this even everything? Oh yeah, I think so. So let's start with... I don't know what I just heard. This small little black one. I literally ordered this all so recently I don't even remember. Oh, this is so cute. It's like a tiny little t-shirt. Look how cute. Look a little party top. Sorry, the lighting's like bad. Can you even see it? Maybe I'll try them all on later. <clears throat> Next. Oh my god, this is so cute. A little white like corset top. It's so cute. This is not everything. It's only three out of, I think, five. Or maybe four? I got a skirt that has a little bit. I don't know why I've been seeing it everywhere. And I feel like it might be kind of cute as like a little staple. You know? I don't okay. That's everything new. I'm gonna start packing now. All right, you guys, it's 8.30. I'm gonna do a quick update before I not go to bed, obviously, but like I'm done packing for the night. I'm just gonna like settle down. I'm gonna try to do some schoolwork actually because apparently there's a lot of schoolwork that I have to do before going to school. So let's, we'll see about that. But let me just give you the rundown. Everything's packed, everything's ready. Okay. This is what I'm wearing tomorrow. I'm actually about to try it on with the dunks. It's just all in bags because it's like my, everything's pretty much new. Um, okay, my room's all clean for the most part. No clothes on the ground. These bags are just like toiletries, hair stuff. I'm going to probably straighten my hair tonight. So I'm keeping this in my room. And then in here is more just, um, <gasps> in here, my makeup bag. And then just like my other little stony clover bags. And this is the big stony clover bag and hair stuff, iPad, my um, computer's charging, and yeah, let me show you downstairs. So yeah, everything's packed, and everything's in my mom's car from the, what's it called? The dining room, all like the big furniture and stuff, that's all in my mom's room. Or, sorry, my mom's car, ready to go. And then everything that I just showed you downstairs will be put into my car tomorrow morning um, before we leave. But yeah, everything's packed, everything's ready. So I just thought I'd give you guys an update and I'll see you tomorrow probably. Okay, quickly, I just thought I'd show you guys my fit because I just threw it on. So the new Align Tank fits perfect, love it so much. 
the new shorts from Revolve. I didn't show you guys these yet, or they're actually aloe, but they're from Revolve. You can't really see them that well in the camera, but they do say aloe, like, oh yeah, <laughs> they're just, um, this is like mesh, so it covers, but you can see it much better in person. The camera just doesn't really pick it up, and they still have a tag on them, obviously, but I love these shorts so freaking much. They have, maybe if I show them to you like this, you can see them better, yeah. So they just have like a tie waistband, then like the mesh layer and the spandex layer. And they're so freaking cute. Just like a little like switch up from like Lulu um, shorts. I'm obsessed. And then the panda dunks. I'm not wearing any socks obviously, but I'm just trying it on. My new sneakers haven't gotten here yet. I ordered two pairs actually. Dana said that he would bring them to me once they arrive. So they should be here in like, I actually have no idea. They had to be like sent to for author authorizing author authentication what is that word called yeah you know what i mean so yeah this is my fit i'm gonna put on my weird pjs and go to bed hopefully soon good morning you guys today is the day <laughs> i literally can't believe it i still can't believe it and it's like the day and i still don't feel like it's real i don't want to go <laughs> <clears throat> well i got dressed at least it's also super early like you can tell by my eyes. It's 9.30. I'm not leaving till like 11 and I'm already packed and everything so it's not like I need to be awake this early. But I woke up at 8.30 by accident. I was setting my alarm for 9 anyway. I was gonna like maybe straighten my hair and stuff but here's the fit. Aloe shorts. I think I should do this this last night. Lulu Align Tank. And I was just about to put on my deodorant. I don't think it's supposed to be too hot today, which is good. I'm also going to wear a hoodie. Um, and I don't think my move-in will take long at all because it's not like a floor walk-up or anything. Like, I'm literally on the first floor and in, like, the hall I'm in is only suites. So, I don't think it's, like, a huge hall or anything with a bunch of floors. So, I don't think it'll be that difficult. Anyway, but we'll get there at... 12 ish and some people one person's i know or like my roommates are like 10 11 12 one of them's one like we're all spread out over the course of the day so i'm no i'm 12 i'm gonna get there at 12 i'm gonna leave here at 11 and get there at 12 so <clears throat> i'm 12 is what i decided i literally didn't sign up for a move in but i'm just gonna hope that once i show up there at 12 they're gonna let me move by seven <laughs> but i mean why would it I'm sure they just have the move-in times as a way to like keep track of how many people at each time, but I could just slip through the cracks. <laughs> I think one of our roommates might have been moved in there. So we have four people we don't know, or three as of now, but four evidently like that we think we won't know. So um, our suite has four doubles, one single. So eight people plus one, so nine people obviously. <laughs> Um, it used to be a seven person single with three doubles and, or seven person suite, sorry, with three doubles and one single, and it was great because we only had two people we didn't know, um, and then they added two more, or they added one more, but it's a double, so we're in a bigger suite, obviously, with nine people, but they think they're gonna add another, like, they just are leaving it empty right now in case they have, like, a random person that they need to put into a room, I guess, so that random person will probably end up being in our suite. So we'll have four people that we don't know. But we've reached out to two of them and talked and spoken to them, so they seem like nice and stuff. I mean, I'm not really, I'm not sure like what the worst case scenario would be. Like, it's not even like they're in my bedroom, so I really don't care. Um, and I'm sure they're like, <laughs> fine. Um, so it's just like kind of scary when you, when it's like people that you've never met before. Like, that's why I was super happy to meet the, few girls before moving in just so we like knew each other and stuff but yeah so i'm gonna do my moroccan oil perfume just because i always do this or the dossier but maybe we'll do a little switch up from the dossier filled up my cup with ice water and i'm gonna take some pills <laughs> i'm just super worried about like once I get there, like, the moving in process will be fine. Everything like that will be fine. It's just once my parents leave and I'm just there alone. And, like, I'm so, so glad to have all these, like, sweet mates because, like, I literally already have, like, f well, at least the people that I met, four girls that, like, 
I know and I'm friends with and like ha like have their numbers and shit and like know them you know so it's like so much better going into it like that than going into it like imagine I just had my own single and didn't know anyone really and like was like all right like let's see how this goes I would be so lonely so I'm glad that like I'm in a suite which like I feel like will force me to kind of like be more social um even though I have a single which I feel like is kind of like the best case scenario package everything in here these are all my like, pills <laughs> And then perfume and stuff is in here. And then the huge bag. This has just like random skincare stuff, but they're all in boxes. So I really just have to like take them out of the boxes and organize everything. But I just like haven't done that yet. So that's what we're going to do when we get to school. As part of organizing, these clothes just came out of the wash. I have like a little pile here. So I'm just going to put these in these bags to bring. Um, and I'm going to do my hair. So hair brush and flat iron. I'm going to straighten my hair. And I'll talk to you guys in a little. I'm gonna let my pills sink in and then maybe we can go to Starbucks or something. In the process, hair's yeah. going. Dad. We moved, so we moved this here. We moved this here. Avery's helping kind of. And yeah, we moved the desk and then we put the wardrobe over there. Shoes will go up there. And then we did the bed skirt. And we'll put a bunch of stuff under here. So I'll update you guys. We have the rug. But I'll update you guys once on And look, it came with a mirror. So I might not even need my mirror. All right, you guys. I'm going to give you, like, I'm going to show you around everything. It's not done. You'll see. But I need to get away from my phone because it's stressing me out. So I was like, perfect time to pick up the vlog camera and update you guys. What is this? Oh, my vacuum. Okay. Sorry, I'm not really situated here yet. And I'm also freezing. And my fan's not even on. So I'm gonna put on a hoodie. So here's my door obviously, but I'm gonna start as if I was walking in and just show you everything. So here we have this LED sign. It hasn't been lit up yet because we didn't have an extension cord, but my mom just brought this. So I'm gonna probably set that up in a sec. So this is from Amazon, linked in my storefront. And then this fan is also Amazon. And yeah, it's the best fan ever. And then we turn to my desk, my little makeup bag. Like I haven't organized anything yet. So I'm going to show you guys everything once it's organized, but I'm going to like organize my makeup into there. And then in the drawers, nothing. <laughs> but I filled the bottom one with like hair stuff and boxed stuff, like extra makeup and stuff. So I'm going to sort through that probably. And then this drawer is empty pretty much. Okay. And then my desk, my makeup mirrors right here, iPad, computers. And then up here, I put my little cousin's um drawing in a little frame. How cute. And then all my perfumes and stuff. I have to take this tag off, but all my perfumes and stuff on this little tray. And then over here we have the, bo the little balloon dog and the, what's it called? Little um, body candles. And then the um, lamp right here is from Amazon too. It's so cute. And then this side of my desk, I just went to Starbucks obviously, but my keys are right there for now. Um, two little random bags then I have another storage thing for like makeup and stuff or skincare and then this is my little phone stand that just goes there I guess and yeah that's pretty much it for the desk oh yeah desk um chair I got a little desk cushion chair for there and I just tied it on how cute so that's from Dormify and then the rug is Amazon it's just a white little shack rug over here I have my backpacks they gave me a Brian backpack but I'll probably still use my Lulu one, a little vacuum right here, a little shark vacuum, um, just like my bag. Trash can has a long thing in it, but trash can. Um, my blender, of course, and a little tray. Like, I don't know what I'm going to do with most of this stuff. Uh, remote for the fan. And then here is my fridge that I rented from the school. Obviously, the trash can's not supposed to stay there because it's blocking the fridge, but there's nothing in the fridge right now. So we're just going to deal with it. So yeah, that's the fridge and freezer. And then we have a microwave thing outside. And then I have my little glasses. Oops, there's styrofoam in there, but in this little thing. Super cute. And then my shower caddy. Body wash, deodorant, toothpaste, t uh, toothbrush, razor, face wash, shampoo, conditioner, shower shoes. That's from Amazon too. It has holes in the bottom, so it's perfect because it doesn't get moldy. And then over here, is my full length mirror. I actually already had one in this room, but I wanted to also put the one that I bought. So yeah, it's the best mirror ever. I don't know why, um, it just is, I love it. I bought it from Sage, so I don't know where it's actually from, but yeah. And then the little um, arch thing behind it is Amazon, just a little like peel stick wall thing. 
the wall decal that I thought was cute. And then moving on to the bed. Let me get like a better view. See, it's hard to like show you guys, obviously, but here's the whole view of the bed. So now I'll get closer and obviously show you. Blanket from Amazon. I have shorts and like random stuff in my bed, but the duvet and everything is from Dormify. Body pillow. I might want to take get rid of this actually. It's just very much in the way. So it takes up like half the bed, so I don't know yet, but Dormify pillows, throw pillows, and then my sleeping pillows. I have just one that matches the comforter and one little satin one. Perfect. And headboard is I actually don't remember where this is from. Maybe it was Amazon. And my LED little lights up here. Amazon Dormify. And then all of these prints are Dormify as well. So those are super cute. And I have a long, yeah, this LED light strip. See? I'm gonna configure it like, you know, next to my bed, like all wiggly like that. So it'll look super cute. And I feel like that'll tie everything together for sure. And then I have my dorm bed skirt, obviously, and just like bedding and stuff. I'll show you under the bed after. Little bedside caddy with my medicine, and I'll like charge my phone and stuff in there. This is my ottoman. It's from Dormify. Then in here, I just put my dresser and two of these bins. One's behind it, so those just have clothes. And then over here, I have just hoodies in three bins. And that's everything under. The dresser just has like, I mean, I'm sure you can assume. And this is obviously so I can get up onto my bed. But I'm going to move it to show you the wardrobe. So here's the wardrobe closet. It's not really closet because it's not built in, but that's okay. Um, I put all my shoes. I can't even hold it high enough. Put all my shoes up there. And then I'll show you inside. it's hard to open okay so see this is where the mirror came but it's okay because it's in a closed door anyway so i hung up all my clothes here bins of just like light bulbs random stuff my straws my cups are in there you know just random stuff and then we have cleaning stuff and like um band-aids just like first aid stuff um laundry detergent and stuff back there and then on this i just hung my robes you guys know i love my robes and um towels for showering hand towels and extra sheets and that's literally everything for now i'll obviously keep you guys updated hi you guys i had a sweatshirt on and i had to take it off because i got really hot but it's day three we've lasted a while okay we've lasted a while it's saturday i moved in on thursday i've been here so long you guys okay so i feel like we have to talk a little bit and then I have to end off this video because I want to, I'll give you like little updates about my room and stuff, um, quickly, but I want to just chat a little bit, tell you guys how it's been and stuff, um, and yeah. I also, um, I'm just gonna kind of like maybe tell you guys like things that were helpful, things that were not like to bring and stuff like that because I don't know if, like, you guys are moving into college or anything, but you can use my tips. This is the perfect setup my windows over there so i love how the lighting looks like coming this way honestly let me update you guys about my room first because i know i gave you a little tour like the day that i got here but um let me show you guys how we um arranged it so right when you walk in i added a little command hook for my keys perfection right and i do have an alarm now so if you attack me i will set an alarm off <laughs> Shoes are still up there. Everything's still the same. Over here, same lights. I added this strip light. I do have to fix it, like, right there. As you see, it, like, looks weird. But the problem is I don't have um, the plug for it. So I can light them all up, all three of these. But that would mean this couldn't be lit. So I'm leaving that unlit for now. Obviously, because it's also just hard. It's, like, more under the bed. And I'll get a little cord for it at some point. But if you want to see it lit, I did take a picture of it, like, on my Instagram story and stuff. And it looks great pictures are the same just helped me with those they look really good like that i think i like the blanket like this just like draped over the end i kind of decided and then did i show you guys when we moved the fridge or when we had the dresser over here or the dresser under here i don't remember but the dresser is now under my bed the fridge is over here it's not plugged in because i do need another extension cord but 
I think other than that everything's the same my little mirror over here you know everything's and this I just got lit up and yeah so before my camera dies let's just do I just want to do like a little recap I'm really sure it's been pretty good so far I mean obviously it's been like super weird because it's just like you literally don't know anyone at first but I'm so glad I'm in a suite. I don't know what I would honestly do if I wasn't. If I had a single not in a suite, I would probably just not leave the single because I'd be, I wouldn't have people, you know? It's so like, I feel like since I have a suite, it's like the ideal situation. I have a bunch of girls that I already like know. Um, so I'm super happy about that. I feel like this was the perfect situation and everyone else is like in my suite. Their rooms all worked out good. So everything's been going well with that. Um, sleeping has been a little bit of a challenge, but it's okay. I think it's just like something to get used to. Um, it's also hot in my room. Like I have this huge fan and I just have to figure out I think how to make it cooler because there's no cold sun. But I also forgot to put it on nighttime mode last night. Maybe that's why but I woke up sweating. The night before I wasn't as hot. So I don't know what the deal was, but um, we do have like an AC thing in here, I think, but I don't know how to work it or I don't know if anyone does. Um, but for the most part, sleeping has been like, okay, I've only slept like five or six hours each night because we had to wake up at like eight or nine because we had little like orientation meeting things. So, um, yeah, but other than that, we haven't really like had too much to do all day. I went to the dining hall a few times. It's like, okay. I've also driven off campus. Um, I just like took a little drive. Um, I just like got back because I just needed to like, I don't know. I felt like I need to like go drive and... I was just literally snapchatting and broke the entire time sending her videos of me ranting about my entire life but love her um and I feel like I'm like not tall but yeah um what else have I met people yeah I met I don't, I'm asking myself questions um I obviously know all the people in my suite which is amazing I'm so happy I met a suite I met like a few people that I just knew or like met over the summer like on social media and stuff so i've met like a few people there's a lot of people i haven't met yet but i mean i'm not surprised like the campus i mean it's not a huge school but it's also not like i'm gonna meet everyone the first few days so um yeah i think i might go home tomorrow i just i don't know i i'm gonna try to stay the whole day today but i'm very like i just feel like i need like a break or something and i don't know i would love to go home today but i don't know I'm gonna try to stay today because today is Saturday and then maybe we'll do something fun tonight or we were just gonna like I don't know we were gonna try to figure out something to do we wanted to like um dress up because these last two nights we've just like been in sweats and stuff and we like have done I mean we haven't really done stuff then that first night we didn't do anything we kind of just sat in the suite it was like kind of nice actually um and last night we went next door for a little bit because it's in this hall it's not by floor the genders it's by each room because it's a, it, the, each um suite has their own bathroom so it's not like the it's not like a you know what i mean so it can be every other is like a girl boy so we just went next door and met like or i met those guys i don't know if my roommates have met them already or not but hung out for a little bit and then just like came back and chilled again but maybe tonight we'll figure out something um to do to like dress up and stuff because we were all talking about how we brought like cute clothes and stuff and we want to put them to use so i think i'll try to stay tonight maybe like go out of my comfort zone a little bit tonight or whatever and then I've, i have been doing it though like i got out of my comfort zone last night and went over there i've been i've been trying to be like you know i just want to try everything and then if i'm uncomfortable i leave you know that's like my thing and i love it how it is here because it's like i live here so i could just go back to my room you know and i know that like i have this space so it really did work out well i'm so so happy about the arrangement that we have it's like literally ideal um and yeah i mean it's only been i guess tonight will be the third night and then i might go home tomorrow um either for the day or come back like monday morning i don't know what we have monday because monday's the fifth so it's still considered welcome week tuesday classes start so monday maybe i'll just i probably won't have too much to do on monday actually also um, but I just will want to like figure out my schedule and stuff so I know what to do on Tuesday So maybe I'll come back like Monday um, Day and try to like meet with someone and figure out my schedule 
So yeah, that's my plan. I don't know if I'm gonna leave or not, but I feel like I just really need a break. This is like a lot and I'm and I am surprised I haven't gone home yet. Like I'm very surprised. But I'm like really proud of myself and I wanna stay as long as I can. So that's my plan. But um I'll I'm gonna end off this vlog here obviously because I feel like I have so much footage of just like everything moving and everything. So I'm gonna end this off here. I'm gonna probably make new vlogs. I'm vlogging on TikTok today, um, just like my day. And yeah, it's just like hard to get situated and like so vlog, you know, because it's like I'm trying to figure out my life and it's like, you know, so I'll definitely be better or like try to be more um, active as I like get acclimated. It's just like weird and like it's weird for everyone. So like that's why I'm kind of okay with it, you know. So yeah, that's the deal. Um, it's pretty good so far. 